Good afternoon, ladies and gentlemen. Wow, what a turnout here at the Student Center, the Student Union. Good afternoon and welcome. For those of you that don't know me, my name is Rod Grabowski, and I'm the new Vice President for University Advancement here at UB. And thank you all for joining us this afternoon. We have some exciting and important news to share as we celebrate the entire university community and look forward to our future. I also want to give a special welcome to everyone who has joined us on Facebook Live. We're delighted to be able to share this special moment in UB history with you. And a shout out to those gathered to be able to, uh, down at Harriman Hall on the downtown medical campus at the Jacobs School of Medicine and Biomedical Sciences. We're having similar gatherings and celebrations at these locations. Today, we're here to think about the future of UB and how we're going to make our dreams, ambitions, and vision a reality. Let's set the stage with a short video. University at Buffalo, for 170 years, in every classroom, every lab, in every field, and in every community. We ask, what does it mean to be bold? It means addressing some of the toughest challenges while turning hardworking students into global leaders year after year. It's important to understand what this university does for the city and region and also for the globe. This university can do wonderful things. They did a wonderful thing for me and I'm so proud of that. I'm so grateful for that. The funding that students get here helps them reach those goals in life. It gives them opportunities they wouldn't otherwise have. We believe that innovative, creative ideas that are going to change the world come when teams come from different backgrounds. Very few people think of taking social work and business and combining them together, and it just opened a whole new world for me. The Social Impact Fellows Program is where we pair an MBA student with a graduate social work student. Students created an award-winning program, helping foster kids leaving care find a bed of their own. We're using that information that we've learned from both worlds to produce a product that is going to really, in the end, help a large population. And it was just really exciting because, you know, what we're doing is actually going to mean something. All we're trying to do is give our students opportunities to work on issues they're passionate about that can actually have an impact here. What does it mean to be bold? It means award-winning faculty guiding students, doing research that tackles some of the most pressing problems across the globe, and in our backyard. It's not research for the sake of research. It's research that is in service of the communities that we work in. Students working in the food lab research ways to give people access to healthy, nutritious food. We're just trying to distinguish between supermarkets and convenience stores. The research translates into action on the ground and then translates into legislation. That's pretty powerful. That in itself is enough of a motivation to always want to do this work. Buffalo has emerged as a national model of how grassroots change in the food system can really make a big difference. It's an extraordinary time to have the university's support in doing impactful work. And colleagues from across the country were saying, we can't believe that that's what's happening at UB. What does it mean to be bold? It means helping millions of people around the world, accomplishing what was thought impossible and leading the charge. There was a time when earthquakes were not considered in the design of structures, period. After a few earthquakes that have essentially destroyed a number of cities, people realize that this can't stay forever like that. Here, engineers test structural components from all over the world to see how they would hold up in an earthquake. So we will go as far as it takes to fail them to see what eventually it will take to destroy them. As an engineer, I mean, we create things that is going to help people in their lives, and I'm happy that I contributed to this field. This is a department that has been at the forefront of research and implementation and having an impact on the world of structural engineering. It's solving real-life problems, real-life uh, issues. With every experiment, innovation, performance, we grow bolder, more tenacious, more ambitious with the problems we work hard to solve. And how can we take that and research it and grow and go beyond 
If we're serious about making education a game changer, then we ought to be investing in public universities. And I hope that my fellow alumni all over the world will begin to reflect the importance of their education at the University of Buffalo, what it's meant for them, and get involved and help out. At UB, we can only do more. Change more places for the better. Discover more ways to solve problems. Foster more leaders to take the reins of the future. We can build this bright future if you invest, if you believe, if you get involved, if you are bold, and you say yes. We are Boldly Buffalo. Are you? I am Rod Grabowski, and I am Boldly Buffalo. The president and many of our deans and senior administrators are here. They are Boldly Buffalo. And as I look at you, our student body, I know you are Boldly Buffalo too. Our announcement today is for you, your future, and our university's future. At UB, we believe access to our outstanding education transforms the lives of our students, inspiring them to think bigger and lead the way. We believe that boldly tackling research is the best way to improve the quality of life, elevate the human condition, and deliver sought-after answers. And we believe that fueling the growth of vibrant, healthy, and inclusive communities here and around the globe is the most direct way to a better world. So what is Boldly Buffalo, and how are we going to do it? To tell you, I'm going to bring up our very special guest, the president of our university, President Satish Tripathi. Thank you, Rod. To me, being bold, bold means launching a historic and transformative fundraising campaign that will have a huge impact on the future of this university. Boldly Buffalo, our place, our way, our future, is the largest campaign ever undertaken in the SUNY system and the largest campaign undertaken in any higher education institution in Western New York. It is a campaign that will benefit the entire university community, from our students to our faculty and staff. And ultimately, it will allow us to further impact the many communities we serve locally and globally. It has already started to do just that. We started counting gifts to this campaign in 2013, and since that time, our alumni and other university friends have already funded 109 undergraduate and graduate scholarships and fellowships. They have already established 13 new endowed chairs and professorships. And this support has helped us create and build state-of-the-art facilities and centers like the new downtown home of Jacobs School of Medicine and Biomedical Sciences, and the Stephen Still Institute of Sustainable Transportation and Logistics. More than 10,000 of our alumni have made their first gift to UB since we started this campaign. We have already received many gifts to direct support to our students. We have already received many gifts to empower our faculty. And we have already received many gifts to improve our world. In fact, we have already at nearly 70% of our ultimate goal for the Boldly Buffalo campaign of which is $650 million. <laughs> this campaign is about the future, one that you play a part in writing every day. It has support and momentum from every level of UB administration, from our donors, alumni, and friends around the world. We are launching the public phase of this historic campaign on a very special day, UB Giving Day. 
This 24-hour initiative is an opportunity for the members of our community near and far to come together and make gift of any size to support UB for this new campaign. At the end of the day, we will show collectively how much we all believe in UB. So let's get UB Giving Day started. I invite all of you to join in countdown for UB Giving Day, starting at 10 and counting down to 1. Those of you watching on Facebook, please join us as well. I would like to ask the deans, the vice president, the vice provost in the audience to come up at this time and join us. Please come. They are coming. Thanks for being here. As I said, this is a university-wide effort and will take every one of us to be successful. Provost Chip Trukowski and Dean Michael Kane of the Jacobs School will lead the countdown at the south and downtown campuses. So here we go. Ten, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, Three, two, one. This Boldly Buffalo campaign will be truly transformative for this university, our students, our faculty, our community, and our world. I hope we can count on you as the UB champions and that we've inspired you to think about how bold you can be for UB. We already have defied expectations by pushing the campaign to this point. As we leave today, remember this. This is our place. This is our way. And this is our future. Please take a moment to give now on your mobile phones or stop by one of our UB giving tables who already have a, a backlog, a ba uh, there's a line actually. This is fantastic support. Um, also, I want to announce, I just got informed just before I came on to stage that Athletics secured today a new gift of $50,000 to support the athletic program. This concludes our celebration. You're, enjoy, you're welcome to stay around, enjoy some of the cupcakes, enjoy some of the games, and each other's fellowship. Thank you for being here.